Albert in San Diego, California writes to me, is it a bad idea to try to connect two preamps, one for stereo and one for surround sound, to one amp and one set of speakers? Is this even possible without disconnecting and switching the RCA cables at the amplifier inputs each time I want to use a different source? Is an RCA switch a bad idea and does it degrade the quality of sound, making this idea not worth the trouble? Um, well, first off, just a real simple, quick answer. You definitely do not want to plug two outputs into a preamp input, into a single preamp input or amplifier input. So when we take a device, whether it be, let's just, let's just for, for, for giggles, we'll just talk about a power amplifier. Maybe that's what he was talking about anyway. See, I can't remember anything. Yeah, he was. Woo! So, <laughs> he can't remember nothing. So, yes, on a single amplifier input, you do not want to plug the output of two anythings. So here's why. A preamp output, a CD player output, anything that has an output is very low impedance. So a typical output impedance for a preamplifier, maybe 100 ohms, maybe 200 ohms, and same with a CD player. And that low impedance plugged into the high impedance of a power amplifier, you're going to have nothing but trouble. And probably the biggest problem you have is taking two competing outputs, a preamp and a CD, or two preamps, or in his case, a surround processor and a preamplifier, and tying them together. Those two low impedance outputs are going to fight each other and wreak havoc. So we don't want to do that. Do not do that. Input impedances of a power amplifier are high so that a low impedance source can easily drive it. And that's all you should do. And your question about using an RCA switcher, yeah, go for it. It's, it's not the highest end audiophile-ish kind of thing to do, but it's certainly better than what you're proposing. And it's not that bad. Just use a high quality switch that you can, I probably find one on Amazon, where just click, click, you know, you've got those two things going. Or if you want to be super purist, unplug one and plug the other in. <laughs> but I, I don't think in your setup, I would hesitate for a moment to use an RCA switch. I say, go for it, make it work. But definitely don't plug the two in together. All right. Thanks for the question. I'll talk to you later.